Okay, if you have a Dell XPS 13 9305 and you're not able to see your SSD when trying to install Windows, here's how you fix it. First, you want to go to the BIOS by pressing F2 or Delete on Startup, and then you want to click the Storage option on the left. Once you've done that, you'll want to go to AHCI forward slash NVMe, select that. After that, click Yes, then click Exit, click Yes to save changes. Then press 12 to get to the boot menu and boot from your Windows installer USB. You should now be able to see your SSD. If there are partitions already on it and you're trying to do a clean install, click them and then click delete partition until it all merges into one unallocated space. Once that's done, just click next and then click install. And that's pretty much it. Your window should start installing. If this video helped you out, please make sure to like, comment, subscribe, share my channel with others so that they can learn how to upgrade and repair their devices as well. And if it helped you save a bunch of money, please consider contributing a little to the channel. Every little bit helps and allows me to continue making these videos for a living. If you can't help out that way, it would help a lot if you could watch a few of my other videos and like and comment on those as well. I also have another channel called It's Been Reviewed and More. If you could subscribe to that channel and then watch a few videos and like and comment on those as well, that would be extremely helpful. Thank you very much, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.